Okay, finally, after two hours of driving, we've arrived. Is this it over here? That's it. What is that, time? Let's, let's go get a massage. Baga. Baga, uh, <laughs> original character. Oh, yeah. That's right. Hey guys, what's up? I'm Eric Surf 6, and today I'm being joined by... I'm Paul from Critical Eats Japan. That's right, he's critical. Yes. And we are at a very special place out in the country. It's a vending machine restaurant. Yes. Hot foods. This is the owner right here, Mr. Yeah. Ishii. Thank you very much. Uh, don't worry. It was delicious. <laughs> yeah, actually, we're doing the intro at the end here. So, uh, yeah, now we'll reverse and eat. It's vending machine food. Yeah. You guys ask for it all the time. Here this it is. This is the place. This is the place. This is the holy grail of up? all vending machines. It was places. a two hour train ride and then another two hours in the car. Oh, so yeah. I'm four hours in right now. And I'm starving. How about you, Paul? Yes, I'm very hungry. I hope okay. it's good. Let's go do this. Let's do it. It's a restaurant with no kitchen, no chef, no staff. Just us. It's a Gutenberger. That looks awful. Udon noodles, yeah, the udon, and here's the udon, here's the ramen. Oh, look at this, man, it's got a toast sandwich. Toast sando. So, it's either tempura udon or ramen. I'm gonna go with the tempura udon. Yeah. 330 yen, that's about uh, $3. Takes 20. Oh, look at that little timer. It's LED. That's so cool. Mm. Yeah, 18 so seconds. Only 20 seconds. Yeah, it's pretty fast. It is. Wow. Look at that. It just pushes it out. Careful not to drop it. Ah, wow. Looks really good. Run out of change. <laughs> okay, we're loaded, ready to go. I think I'm going to go with this is tartar through meat though, yeah, and bacon. It's like uh, chopped meat, I guess. Chopped meat, minced, right. yeah, okay. Three dollar hamburger, okay. yeah. This one takes that's the same timer. 60, 60 seconds. Uh, okay. What's it doing? I think it's oh, no. down the tenth of a second. Like it's down really? the last. There we go. I heard a bell. Oh. Yeah, so there it is. It's in a box. A box. Oh, it's tiny. Yeah. Okay, and this is the uh, toasted sandwiches. Yeah. Does it really come with parsley? I don't and know. a cup of coffee too? No, probably no, not. Probably not. So there's ham cheese, which smells really good because this lady over here uh, just got it. And there's uh, something with mayonnaise, garlic. Like sliced garlic and ham. Oh yeah, I gotta get that. Yeah, garlic, ham. mayonnaise, yeah. 250. A little, little more than $2 for a toasted sandwich. Toast the chew. It means the toaster is activated. <clears throat> is there a timer on this one? Oh, no timer. This, this thing here? What's that? Or is that? The, oh, that's the temperature. the temperature inside that's there, huh? Yeah. And look at this. You see, you got to put on the little mitten. You get yourself some tongs. And you get yourself a tray, see? I am set up. What do I need the tongs for if I have this? Um, there you go. <laughs> That's how you do it. Okay. Oh, it's very okay. hot. Yeah. So it's really hot. Very hot. And tsuroi, tsuroi oishi. Got to go outside to get a drink. Because they only have Coke in there. They have Coke in the bottles, but I don't really drink Coke anymore. Paul does, though. Yes. Yeah. Uh, so anything appeal to you here? There's no green tea. No? Did you say there was Let's go to the coffee. Oh, Wait, 
Coca-Cola. Yeah. The Coca-Cola machine about. sells green tea. Yeah, he said there was another machine oh, over yeah, here. Oh yeah, right there. Oh wait, it's got Dr. Pepper. <laughs> Dr. Pepper is very, very rare in Japan. Yeah. Ah, uh, should I get it? <laughs> it does have doctor in the name. It can't be as bad as Coke, right? Yes. I'll push them both at the same time and then whichever one I get, I get. That's, that's fair, right? That's fair. Got the green tea. Okay. I was hoping that for the Dr. Fair. Pepper. This is the uh, car corner over here. Yeah. This is a little private place to eat. Yeah, this is nice. Got three items here. I think we'll start with the burger. Okay. It's called the Taru Taru Meat Doll, which is minced meat, I think. Is that right, Paul? Yeah. It's pretty cool. Steak, steak tartare. Look at how the box opens. It's pretty cool. Yeah. I like the packaging. It's in a box, and inside the box is a wrapper. It smells really good. Yeah. Let's see how it looks. Looks. Oh boy. Looks like a disaster. Oh my. It smells like a meatball. So it's like a meatball. And it, again, it's soggy. It's an actual. Uh, okay. And they call that a piece of bacon. It looks like ham. Okay. But the smell is there. So it is smell. an actual patty? It's not. I'll let you know in a second. I'll let you know. Hmm. Mm. It's it's like a meatball. Yeah. Meatball. Okay. Yeah, processed. There's like a chili sauce on here. Mm-hmm. That's good. Yeah. Good flavor though. The bun good. the bun is a zero though. It's yeah. Yeah, it's it's really soggy on the bottom right. and then it's hard on the top, like a doormat. Hmm. I don't know. I mean, the, the patty's huge volume. Look how thick that is. It's definitely meaty. Yeah. Mm. Mm. There's not, not much to it. Just meat, bacon, sauce, mm -hmm. and a chewy bun, I guess. Yeah. <clears throat> Kid friendly. Yeah. Meh. 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 <laughs> Alright, green tea. Went for the green tea. We're all to go. Okay, so let's try the stuff that I just bought. Um, let's kick it off with the Mexican burger here. And it comes in this little box. See, si, senor. Just, you just tear open. Chan chan. Like that. And inside it is wrapped in paper. Let's scoot this out of the way here. Yeah. It's, it's been hey, sitting look. for a minute or is two. Is that a surveillance camera over here? What is that? It's a yes. surveillance camera. Being is that yours? Yes. Okay, so inside we have this. <laughs> I guess it speaks for itself. It's tiny. Open it up. Let's, it's tiny. Let's get a look at it. And in it's there. hard on the top and soft on the bottom. But yeah. Let's crack this open. This was the Mexican burger. So yeah. It, what, what's it, so Mexican about it? It has uh, jalapenos, I guess. Oh, jalapenos, yeah. okay. I mean, look at that patty there. It's, yeah, it's look like a that. giant meatball. It's like a giant meatball. You care yeah. to add any wasabi or mayo? Um, I'm gonna give it a bite first and we'll okay. see if it needs that. Okay, trust me. Who am I kidding? <laughs> trust me, it needs right. it. Okay, <laughs> yeah, it looks, uh, yeah, yeah. Does it look critical? Mm. Yeah. Does it pass Paul's critical test? Was it the same on yours? The top one is like yes. total astroturf, and the bottom one <laughs> is just this sponge, you know what I mean? Yeah, same, wow. same experience. Anyone who's ever put bread in the microwave, that's exactly what that is, right? It gets all hard. It does. Yeah. I do like the jalapenos though. It does have a good flavor, but 
it's kind of a soggy mess, so I don't know. Should I, should I throw on some mayo? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, sorry. Ed. Use your pants. Okay. Okay, mayo. And what's this green stuff again? It's called wasabi. Wasabi. Oh, no, that, no, you don't want to go that heck. Well, that'll what? make it interesting. Yeah. Let me, let me, definitely let me gonna spread change, that out. Definitely going to change the overall flavor. Yeah. Kick up the spice. Okay. Improvise this. There we go. Chopstick knife. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Did that bump it up to critical level? It's good. It still feels terrible, but tastes a lot better. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Had enough of that for now. Next up is the, uh, this is udon noodles. Chopsticks right here. Also the table's got condiments, look. So there's, uh, you can add, actually I brought this. This is uh, red pepper spice. Karashi, togarashi it's called. Okay, a bit of salt and pepper. Nothing's coming out. No. What's this? <laughs> That. Oh, oh the, this this came from the toy, from the box. toy box. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But it does. They do have yeah. salt and pepper though. Coleslaw. Bit of pepper. No, well, that should be good. Oh, actually, so actually, see, I brought this, and then here it is, right here. I didn't uh, did not need to bring it, but I've also got wasabi and some mayo too. Which I won't be using either of for this. All right, here we go. So this is um, tempura udon. Tempura on the top, udon noodles on the bottom. And it's like it's a mixed tempura, so vegetables. Ugh. Ugh. That good? Oh, it's like it's like baby food. Really? Yeah, soggy. Not happening. Oh, How are the noodles. Yeah, the uh, temper let's get into the noodles. A okay. Soggy, but mm -hmm. a bit soggy. Here goes. The noodles are pretty good. I'll tell you what. For coming out of a machine, not bad. Plus, I'm really, really hungry. It's two o'clock in the afternoon, and this is my first meal. But this tempura, this tempura, <laughs> it's mostly batter. Yeah. You know, there's not there's not uh, that many veg there's not that many vegetables in it. Does it taste pretty? Uh, I guess you did throw a bunch of spices on it. Mm -hmm. Apart from that, it needs it. It needs it. Yeah, it's pretty basic. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And the soup is uh, it's one for a drink. It's pretty bland. Not much going on with the soup. <laughs> what is that you got there? Fried rice. This is some sort of ramen. However. Oh yeah, all the toppings are down at the oh, bottom. Oh, so. that, is that Charlie? That's pork. Yeah, that's the chashu. Score. Looks like a mushroom there. Wonder how fresh that's going to be. Yeah. So we've got a whole heap of noodles. Um, is this like a shoyu maybe? The sauce? It's like a darker sauce anyhow. And that's about it. Shoyu ramen. Yeah. I don't really see. Oh wait. We got one of the doilies Yay. fish cake. Yeah. Um, I call it a doily. A bit of seaweed. Is it called a na naruto? Is that what that thing's called? I'm not sure. But anyhow, let's dive right in and enjoy this ramen. So I do eat I do eat school lunch, so I have had questionable ramen before. <laughs> I'll just say that. Certainly not the best ramen I've ever had, but you can 
tell that it's ramen, so that's uh, that's a plus, I guess. You can tell that it's ramen, yeah, as, you know, as, as opposed ramen to some flavor. other food. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Is it critical? Chashu is pretty good. But is it critical? It's not critical. <laughs> <laughs> I am fascinated by your channel name, can you tell? <laughs> Critical Eats Japan. What exactly does that mean, Paul? Have you ever explained that to your audience? I, I think they'd be I think interested so. to a hear. Few, there's a few Q&As on my channel. You okay. should go check them out if okay. you want to know the answer to that it's, question. Otherwise, it's a 30-minute story. Yeah. Okay. Right. So, yeah. It's something I mean, to do with punk rock. Tastes fine. 300 yen, was it? 350 Yeah, about maybe? three bucks. Huh. Mm-hmm. Oh, shit. YouTube、はい。見せよ、何年ぐらいですか ?3年。あ、3年ぐらいやってる。3年だけそうそうそう。おお。really?はははは。わお。あの、機械が古いですか古い古い。だ、だいたい何年ぐらい前自分が50歳
Let's use the uh, let's use the tin foil here, aluminum foil. Ready? Going in. Mmm. Oh, it's cheesy. 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 Oh, really? Mm-hmm. A lot of cheese on this. Wow. Oh man, the wasabi, the mayo. Oh, it makes it. Yeah. <laughs> How's the garlic? It's got some kick. Does it? Mm-hmm. You did warn us about it. Oh, this is good. <laughs> yeah. This is the best item. Mm-hmm. The uh, crust is a little hard. Well, that's okay. Oh man, this is food porn right here. Delicious. I think this is the best item. Mm-hmm. They could use some napkins. Uh, Tissues. Yeah, that's true. I'll just use my pants. Okay. Mm. Mm. Wow. Oh. Delightful. So the final item did I you, got. Did you say you think this is better than instant ramen? Yeah. No? So let's enjoy this toasted sandwich. What's up with that? <laughs> Why is that on the outside? Oh. Is that? Oh, that's a miss. What happened? So. Can you, you want to ask the guy? I don't know. Let's ask him. <laughs> see, see, see what I'm saying? See what I'm saying? This sandwich. So the knock I got, knock I got, and so. So, the soto baju. Oh, oh, this, oh, oh, this is on purpose. Menu, uh, oh, uh, uh, I see. Original. So you get both, so double meat though. Uh, no, cheese. So, cheese, cheese, cheese. Double the cheese. Cheese, cheese inside. Cheese inside, cheese, ham, cheese, ham cheese and mustard. Um, ham. Soto wa, uh, only one. Only one. Uh, I see. Kobashi to wakaru. Oh, this one? No, 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 why not, right? Why not, yeah. Why, why not? Get your hands, get your hands on why, Mexico. Why not? napkins in here. Okay. So, here, here we go. <laughs> Itadakimasu. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Do, does it need any of the uh, following condiments? What do you think? Yeah. Definitely needs. Is it a bit dry, is it? Also, I might want to, like, slide this inside as well. <laughs> Hope he doesn't notice. But <laughs> get out of my shop! Yeah, it's a little bit dry. It's it's dry and wet at the same time. Soggy. Yeah. Man, you go hard on the wasabi. Go wasabi. Wasabi mayo, daisuke. Crispy. A crispy, ne? So if they cook it inside, it's just this, you know. Spongy kind of right. thing. It makes so it crispy. That's outside. Fine. Okay, that makes sense. Supposedly. Yeah. Is it crispy? Um, it looks crispy, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wasabi mayo, daisuke. I feel, I feel guilty. Huh? <laughs> I feel guilty being watched by the owner <laughs> as I add that to his sandwich. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Definitely didn't get his. Uh, Seal of approval for like that. that. No, he's like, what are you doing? I'm glad we talked to him before. <laughs> mm. This is good. This is very good. Yeah, I think this wasabi is not that hot, actually. Oh. Right? Hmm. You haven't even touched your Coke over there. Yeah, yeah. No? It's 
So it came out of a vintage machine, but it's it's still just a normal normal Coke. It's not uh, like vanilla Coke or a peach no, Coke. This is straight normal straight. Coke. Yeah. It's got cocaine in it. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Used to, right? I think so, yeah. The original Coke. It was the way they called it the Wonder Drug, right? Did they? The Wonder Drink. Yeah. So, yeah. There you go. <laughs> this was okay. I wasn't as excited as you were, but after adding that, it really improved it. After adding that, it really improved it. Yeah, they were all... Novelty factor, it's off the chart, you know? But taste-wise, very always, all very kind of bland, I guess. This guy, he's, he's really going for it, man. Yeah. A lot of maintenance happening. Cute, cute underwear, Where too. Where you focusing on me? Right. <laughs> you can put that on your channel. <laughs> okay. Well, that certainly hit the spot. I am stuffed. There's a lot of volume with this food. First, I had the, uh, the burger. The burger was uh, interesting. Definitely interesting. Um, it kind of reminded me of a meatball. Yeah, but very meaty, for sure. Uh, not not bad flavor overall. I especially liked having the wasabi and the mayonnaise on it. Really added the flavor that it needed. I think um, the udon noodles were kind of so-so. Don't show it. Oh, I'm sorry. Because I eat everything. I apologize. That's okay. You want to redo that? No, 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 no. So the uh, <laughs> the udon noodles were uh, were pretty good, respectable, but the tempura on top was um, <clears throat> no, no, not having it. Too soggy. And then finally, my favorite item was the toast sandwich. Yep, that was amazing. Really enjoyed that, even though it was a bit soggy too, but it had the most flavor. Yeah, and very cheesy. So overall, I'm going to give this meal, uh, considering everything, the uniqueness of it that it came out of a machine, I'm going to give it a five-star ranking. It's a nom nom. So not quite a six. Yeah, the quality of the food is just not there. Definitely, if you want the best food in Japan, go to a restaurant for sure. But it's an, it's an awesome novelty, and these machines are really old. And it was cool to get to interview the owner this time. So this one was special. <clears throat> so I'd like to thank you guys for watching, and make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Tell me what you thought. And if you'd like to see some more from this same restaurant, go check out Paul's video. It's linked right up there. Go check out Critical. Critical East Japan. Yeah, he's got a great channel. He's got some great videos. And I know that you guys like Japanese food, right? A lot of you. He's got a lot of that stuff. He does more of the uh, fast food kind of items. So if you're interested, go check it out. Link's right there. And we will see you guys in the next Eric Meal Time. Eric out. If you're new, hit that subscribe button top center of the screen. And also consider supporting me on Patreon. That way you can help me create better videos for you. Click on the link bottom center of the screen. For that, you can see many of the different reward levels for your support. Be well, and we'll see you soon.